Hello, this is Naomi from The Profile Company and in this video I want to show you how to clean up your profile if your entries are banding together with the new chronological function that LinkedIn have put together. So if you have worked for the same organisation for a long time and advanced through various positions, absolutely great, this function really works for that. But if you are someone who's an entrepreneur and especially an author, you may have multiple entries for the same company. This does happen quite often and for a variety of reasons. And right in front of us now, we have one particular reason. Um, this is a profile I wrote for Sue Ingram, who is um, helping managers handle difficult conversations in the workplace and avoiding the need for them in the first place. She has written a really fantastic book called Fire Well, How to Fire Staff So They Thank You. It's part of her company, Converse Well, which she's had for almost nine years now. When I wrote the profile, we put in an extra entry, author and speaker, for the, um, for the position because um, it, we needed to feature it. We wanted to feature her as a speaker and we also wanted to feature the book. And we didn't have enough space inside of what we were saying about the company to achieve this. So it all went inside of one. And as you can see there, we split it up into the book um, and also the speaking engagements as well. The trouble is, is now it's all hidden behind the see less you can see not much is actually coming forward. It's, it's kind of lacking. So it would be nice to be able to keep the logo in both positions and have them wide open and looking good. But for that, we'd have to create a new company page. Let me explain. I'm going to split these two. I want them to be split so it looks more prominent on the page and looks good. You can see each new entry is split with a line and split with a logo. We want that for her book. We don't want it to be in this chronological order. So we're going to split it. What we're going to do is we're going to click on the blue pencil and as it comes up you can see here the company. The reason why it's in the chronological is because the company matches the one above. So I'm just going to delete that so there is no company um, and just put uh, author and it looks like there's lots of options there. I don't really want one of those so I'm just going to click away. Do you mean to choose author? writing and editing, I'm going to go no, because I don't know whose page that is or what that's connecting to. Um, I could put anything there, I could put various, I'm going to go with that for this video, just for now. Uh, I'm going to click save, and as you can see it split itself off. Um, so well, actually what I'm going to do, this is another great thing, you can just copy that um, and actually just put the name of the book in, why not? It's going to have good SVO. Um, and it's also going to stand out. So sometimes we do things, we look at them and see how it goes. And as you can say, author and speaker, fire well, how to buy a star, say thank you. It now looks like actually that there, you can see there's no space between London, UK and the top paragraph. Just a weird thing LinkedIn does. Um, so I'm going to actually delete that, um, that title there because it's now absolutely spoken about above. And I'm going to leave that space and hopefully that space will stay in. Yeah, so I've left the space there, which is great because it's, it's creating that, uh, that, you know, pausing that you need in, in these kind of things. It all slams together a little bit too much otherwise. Um, so that looks really tidy and we've managed to split that off. So now when you look at this, we've got um, the HR consultant, facilitator and coach, and then we've got author and speaker. It's a real negative that we can't get the logo in there. In order to get the logo into this box, we're either gonna to have to go back to how it was before, which I think doesn't have much going for it, or we're going to have to start up a whole new company page. It might be that we could start up a company page just for the book, so that the book actually comes through here, but that's gonna mean keeping, maintaining it, and looking just it could get really messy. So we're gonna go without also, I have a suspicion, having spoken to LinkedIn, that very soon we might just have a, an author's section. So this might end up with its own section with a featured book anyway. If you agree that that's worth having, please comment on this video. I think that we should have Amazon and LinkedIn connected so authors can get the prestige that they need for their book and that their hard work, the book they spent all those hours sweating over, isn't just lost inside of three publications. Click down and that's all we can see for them. Um, so if you agree with me that you think that actually Amazon and LinkedIn should be linked so your book can be featured, let me know in the comments. 
Um, and also let me know if this video has been helpful and if you've got any kind of technical questions like that about how to split things down or how to make things look, then please do get in touch. Um, you can email naomi at theprofile.company and I'll do my best to write you a bit, get your video and send you back the answer and also write a new blog post about it. So I hope this has been useful. If you are someone who has worked with me before and I've actually put the two together, this might be something you just need to go back through your profile and just unconnect them. There are lots of really good benefits to this chronological ordering, but not when you're an author speaker in your own company. All right. Thanks for listening.